PC Wizkid here, very excited to show you something new from SK Hynix, the Gold S31 one terabyte SSD. Now, SK Hynix has been around for a long time making memory modules for laptops, for example, enterprise level SSDs. Now they've entered the North American market here with a retail uh, SSD, as you can see right here in this box, very nicely packaged is the Gold S31 SSD. Now. Um, I'm very excited to try this out because this is the first time that we're actually dealing with uh, a retail market and uh, it's all made by SK Hynix when it comes to this. So they're really aiming at gamers and people who want to upgrade their machine. They know that uh, they've got their own proprietary SK Hynix Quartz controller. They know they they're, you're going to be using their 3D, um, 72 layer 3D uh, TLC uh, NAND flash. You know that uh, the, the DRAM that's in there also is made by SK Hynix, the LP DDR3 memory that's in there. And uh, it's supposed to reach 560 megs per second on the sequential read and 525 megs per second on the sequential write. So I'm looking forward to that as well as the uh, advertise the write endurance is about 600 terabytes. So uh, that should last you for uh, quite some time. Um, five years warranty, like I said, they behind their product obviously and uh, it's good quality and construction when I took it out of the box nice aluminum housing solid you know one piece there you can see there that it looks really really nice it's an elegant uh, SSD very lightweight obviously so if you want to maybe put this in your laptop for example so um, you know it's not going to add any weight to it uh, in fact, it's probably lighter than a regular hard drive, so this would be a good upgrade to migrate from your old hard drive to a new SSD. This would prob probably be the best choice uh, for a mainstream, you know, starting off. Now, inside the uh, SSD, I don't recommend you open this up, but you can see there that there's the three chips. Again, all proprietary by SK Hynix. Uh, when it comes to the benchmarks itself, I'm running it on my desktop, so I installed it in a desktop machine instead. And um, basically, when it's idle, not doing anything, the SSD itself is going to be around 26 degrees Celsius. If I uh, do a lot of work, read and write on the actual SSD, it bumps up the temperature to about 43 degrees Celsius. Okay, so there you got a you know an idea on the uh, you know the the range that it's working with. The sequential read and writes on the Addo benchmark that I did here are bang on what they advertised and also on Crystal Disk Mark. Actually, they're slightly above what they advertised, which is great. I like to see um, benchmarks that actually exceed expectations, and that's what I'm seeing here with this. Of course, different tools will give different benchmarks, but I'm seeing consistency here, and that's pretty darn good. Uh, the uh, operations per second, again, very good for a mainstream drive. This is not, you know, going to, you know, uh, break world records, but it's consistent with an SSD of this class. Now, how could I compare this to other SSDs? Well, if we take the disk mark score here of 5189 that I did on the uh, performance test 9.0 and uh, look up online with other SSDs, you can see how this one compares to other models of other brands, okay, in case you're wondering about that. Okay, so you can pause the screen and take a look at that at your own pace. It also comes with a little utility, a free utility tool to migrate your system from an old hard drive to this SSD, right? Make this now your boot drive for Windows 10, for example, or your MacBook or whatever it is that you want to use this for. Uh, it, it'll support Linux, your Mac, or Windows OS. Now, um, I, it's nice to have these utilities. It's there for you to clone your drive should you need that. Um, I like the fact that you know, they stand behind their product with five years warranty. Here are the price points for the different size SSDs, should you uh, want a different size. And again, uh, I like the aluminum finish. I always like, you know, a nice solid construction so you know it's going to, you know, be strong and, uh, you know, you're not going to break it easily. So definitely recommend this drive. Uh, comment below. Let me know what you think about it. I'll add the link below for the latest prices uh, in case there's any new deals coming out. And I'd like to thank SK Hynix for providing it. And again, Thank you for watching.